If you have a smartphone and travel frequently, it's almost impossible that you haven't used Google Maps. The initial versions of Google Maps relied only on data from traffic sensors and cameras that were installed by government transportation agencies and certain private companies that compiled traffic data for various purposes. Initially, Google would obtain this information and then embed it in Maps for people to use. Google Maps now uses crowdsourcing to run the app and feed its users the most recent traffic updates on the go. Since 2009, Google Maps has utilized crowdsourcing to enhance the accuracy of its traffic updates and predictions. When you're driving and your phone's location is turned on, it sends bits of data anonymously to Google Maps. In this way, Google learns how fast your device and by extension, your car is moving. The same is true for the other cars on the road. Their phones are also sending bits of data to the Google database. In other words, it's your phone and the phones of your fellow drivers that feed Google Maps with the data it needs to provide live traffic updates.